what is going on guys welcome to the another android application development tutorial in android studio in this video we are going to learn how to start our new android studio project for the first time and run the android studio project on our device or application or the emulator so let's start with a new android studio project create and start a new android studio project so it will open a window where it will ask for our android application name give the application name like whatsapp facebook it is my first application so i am giving my first app so company domain name company domain is your domain name what is your domain name you can give anything if you don't have a domain name if you have domain name give the domain name i am giving johncena.com anything you can't okay now the project location give your project location anywhere in your drive where you will feel easy and give the package name here comes the important point give the package name unique so that your application will be unique so i am giving here com dot anything it will again take the company domain name and the application name so you can also change but i am taking as it is click on next so here you will select the minimum sdk version the version of android minimum which will support this application so i am selecting 4.0 because i want my application to be run more than 4.0 on any version so just click on next you are uh, if you are uh, making for tv or anything right now for phone and tablet click on next so select the activity from here here are list of activity which we are we can uh, develop but right now i am selecting empty activity this is our first project so in later on um, videos we will learn how to uh, use these all activities so right now click on empty activity and next so here we have the activity name and layout name so give the activity name main activity as it is and layout name activity main as of now because we have only a single activity in this application click on finish so it will load our project for the first time So there, it will take some time to load our project. Here, building is running. This is the user interface of uh, Android Studio. So there are two main things right now: main activity dot Java and activity main dot XML. This main activity dot Java is the file where we can write java codes we can create classes we can create methods we can do the coding part and this activity main.xml is the designing part where we can add text view buttons images scroll bars any widgets or layouts anything we can add you can design in this part so this activity main.xml is designing part and main activity java is coding part so first of all we have to design this application so go to here design we can see the preview or go to text and uh, click here on preview so another window will be displayed it will preview our application just zoom out zoom in so that we can see clearly so first of all we are going to remove this constant layout and we are going to write linear layout we will learn the about layout in another videos so right now just change this constant layout to linear layout don't worry about anything what is layout uh, we will learn in another video this is only the starting part so we are uh, learning how to display our text like this remove the text view that is what's hello world in this so remove that now we have application name and the empty activity so let's add some text like welcome to the application welcome to my first application because it is your first application so add text view text view is something which will show which will display our text so it will ask for width the layout width if we write wrap content it uh, will wrap the content means if we write hello this width will be up to hello if you write long text it width will be long so right now i am displaying match parent i am because i want full length so for height only wrap content i don't want full height so wrap content for height and for width match parent it will match the parent means main activity 
so another thing we have to add is android text there are different properties text color text size text text color hint another direction or anything right now we are adding only text that is welcome to my first application so this is our text displayed on our application so we, if we want to increase the text size we have property text size it will give the hint also press enter give the text size 30 dp if it is too big 25 dp it is if it is too small 100 dp we can set any text size so right now i am giving 20 dp or 25 dp so this is our first application welcome to my first application if you want to another text below that text just copy this copy this and paste over here change this to developed by John Cena and give text size small and it is not displayed here because it is linear layout and we have to give the orientation that can be vertical or horizontal right now I am giving vertical so that I want to display vertically the items so when we add another text view or another thing it will display vertically so we can align this also at center so if you want to align uh, gravity I think gravity center okay layout gravity or gravity so it will go to the center and your gravity center it will display in center so this is our application we can uh, run this application to check whether it is running or not if you want if you do not have any virtual available virtual devices here create new virtual devices and you can create a select any of the devices according to requirement and click next to create a new virtual devices so it will create virtual device i have created already created this nexus 5x so i will run on this i will click ok to check whether it is displayed as it is or not in my application because this is my first application it will run it should run we are not going to change anything on main activity to java because we are not coding anything we are only we have only changed the design so we will learn this thing in upcoming videos this is first video so we are learning the basic thing to display to run our project to run our first application so yes it has run this is my first app this is our application name this we have written the text and this we have written the text in center so this is our text here displayed here and this is text displayed here so you can change anything and run so for our first application is ready so that's all for this video i hope you have liked this video if you have any queries or questions please comment down below i will reply so see you in the 